Two major retailers are limiting the purchases of children's pain relievers like acetaminophen and ibuprofen. This comes as pharmacies are also seeing a shortage of antibiotics. CBS 17's Bria Hollingsworth has more now on what companies are trying to do to help. CVS is just one company taking action right now. You can only purchase up to two children's pain relief products. I just went inside the CVS store just a couple of minutes ago and found that the majority of shelves were empty when it came to children's medication. Now, if you do have a sick kid, finding over-the-counter children's medicine may become a lot harder due to a shortage. Walgreens and CVS are just a few major retailers limiting the purchase of children's over-the-counter pain medicine. In addition to CVS, Walgreens told us that they are only allowing a purchase of six per online transaction. The Consumer Healthcare Products Association points to a large demand driven by a rise in pediatric cases of respiratory illnesses, including the flu, COVID, and RSV. Now, in a statement, Walgreens told CBS 17 that they are working diligently to anticipate and avoid product shortages where possible by partnering with new and current suppliers and distributors to minimize the impact and inconvenience for patients and customers. Now, this comes as Companies are seeing shortages in other medications, including antibiotics, ADD medication, and diabetes. Some shortages could last until early next year. In Raleigh, Braille Hollingsworth, CBS 17 News.